back to Spoonercraft. It's a very special episode we've got for you here. Uh, we're going to have to keep an eye out for Matt, though. Make sure he doesn't join in and start watching the stream, because today we're going to be pranking Matt back. That's right. Thought about it, and I've got a, what I think is a decent idea for a prank. It's not, not too horrible. He's not going to, you know... Too much of his stuff isn't going to be messed up by it. So, we're going to head over to Matt's base. I should probably make sure I have everything I need before we go over there, don't... Shouldn't I? Yeah, okay, cool. So I'm going to be... I've got Mixer open on my laptop, and I'm going to be keeping an eye on uh, the list of chatters, people who are watching my my stream now. If we see Matt show up, we'll have to like, I don't know, I don't know what I'm going to do if Matt shows up, because there isn't really anywhere to hide over there. I don't know what he would have done either, I mean, maybe just run out. No, let's see. Mixer is frozen on my laptop, let me reload it. I really hate this run. Super dangerous. He really needs to close this off. This is this could be a real liability if like a creep or not a creeper. If a ghast like blasts a hole in this uh this bridge here, you could fall down it and end up in lava and it would be not very good. Skeleton was following me for a while. I do really like this grass path. When I saw him making it, and he only did these like little splotchy bits of path, I was like, I don't know how I feel about that, but it's grown on me. I think it's kind of nice now. So here we are in Matt's base. This will be the first time you guys see it from my perspective, if you've been watching my solo streams. It's funny, he's got this like little workstation up here. It's kind of apart from everything else. Looks like he's got a hole there. I wonder what happened. Maybe he just ran out of wood. I don't know. Anyway, we're going to go around to his beach house here. It's one of the biggest houses he has so far, except for maybe that one over there. I hope I have enough in order to do it, but I am going to fill this entire house with sand. Have it spilling out the front door, too. Blame it on some young ruffians. Young hoodlums. Swinging through and wrecking his beach house. So let's get started. This isn't going to be a very long stream, so I haven't decided if I want to time-lapse the whole thing yet. Oops, I just busted. Oh, somebody else is watching. Who's watching? Who's watching? Retro gaming. Okay. It's not math. Hello, retro gaming. Sorry, dude. It's a private server. Why is this breaking? It makes me sad. I don't know what the best way to do this is. I guess just like layer at a time. this. Oh, that works. wonder what the limit is for this sand to fall, for it to break. So it can fall three blocks. 
Can't fall on the wood though. Maybe you can just fall on other sand. Poof. But yeah, Matt's up in northern Virginia visiting his in-laws. So I'm hoping he won't sign on, but if there's like a lull during the day, he might decide to, to hop on to see what's going on. Because I think he gets notifications whenever I'm streaming. There we go. That works. Yeah, if any of you watched Matt's stream or one of my previous videos, you'll you would have seen the prank that he pulled on me, which I thought was amazing. He's always been commenting about how one of my buildings is so damn huge, so he uh, made it like the hangar that fills up with uh, that actually has clouds in it. It's just so damn big. Thought it was pretty amazing. Oop. Oh, it pushed me off. You know, getting it up into the very last space is always a little hard, but other than that, it's going pretty well. Um, if I do end up having to go get more sand, I might just um, do a jump cut instead of a time lapse, because it depends on how long this ends up taking. It's already been eight minutes. So much sand. Man, they, these, these hoodlums really tracked in a lot of sand. I don't know how they managed to track in this much. This is impressive. <laughs> do, 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 do. Boop, 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 do, do, do. Oops, that's breaking. There we go. Pop open the list of chat viewer list again so I can keep an eye on who's showing up. It's been ten minutes, I think I'm probably pretty safe. If he hasn't joined in by now, he's probably not thinking about it. There's going to be like one spot that I won't be able to get sand into. Also, I like, I could probably just go through the top of the house and then replace it. I think I'll do that just so that it's full. I think there's a spot on the other side too that I didn't fill in. I want it to be literally the entire house. I know he's probably not going to be able to tell when he's taking this down, but it's the principle of the thing. I think it 
was this one over here. Yeah. Boop. There we go. Top floor done. Poof. So funny that it does that. Top piece is super hard. Eh. Hmm. How do? Can I get on top of it from here? Yeah. Whoops. This is trickier than I thought it would be. It's interesting. Oh man. Might have to do this from the top again. It's getting to be nighttime. Man, oh well, that's fine. He's got the half slabs here. Can't actually make it go all the way up to the very ceiling. But that's okay. Ooh, can't even drop one block onto non sand. Go to sleep. I don't like being out during the night time. Boing, boing, boing. Looks like I'll have just enough. Top floor was bigger than the bottom floor. No guitars or a drawing from you. <laughs> Almost. It was a very quick prank. But that's okay. You know, I considered filling, like, covering the entire house in sand. I thought that would be hilarious, but, uh, kind of want it to not be obvious, because uh, I apparently went many weeks without noticing my prank, so I kind of want him to do the same. Want it to not be obvious. Want him to just stumble across it one day. I guess I can't put sand here, right? Yeah. My share of the blame. I don't know how often he comes across this side of the, the building. Take this off. I'm fucking up his pathway, but that won't take very long to fix. <laughs> I'm 
put need to make a chest and a sign. Let's see if he has any signs. Cause I don't want to, have to make like whatever it is, three or six of them and then not use them. Should have brought one with me, but I didn't think about it. If I have to, I'll just leave the other signs in here. Yeah, he doesn't have one. Here, have some sticks too. Let's have it go all the way down to the set meet up with the sand down here. That'll be a nice look. There we go. Why didn't it? Shift T two colon A. Ah, won't we work? Why can't I? What? Something going on. That just goes up and down. Let's try this the old fashioned way. Oops. There we go, this is working now. Do mat. I need to take this out. Here's the book. Dear Matt, I came to visit your village, and some hoodlums were having a party in your beach house. I ran them off, but they managed to track a bunch of sand into the house. You really should have better security. Oops. The shift on this doesn't work very well. Beach bones. Right there. All right. So now it's here waiting for him. Let's see how long it takes him to notice. This is kind of like off in the side of his village. So it's like not maybe a place that he normally goes to. I have a feeling he like normally takes these avenues over here, kind of walks around this area. Working on this big old box of a house. I think it's probably going to be his like storage room because it looks like a big chest. That would be something that Matt would do. Looks pretty cool. Anyway, that's going to do it for me for this episode of uh, Spoonercraft Pranks. Thanks for hanging out with me. See you next time. Tune in on Saturday or Monday, depending on whenever this goes up. He has to notice it first, obviously, before I post it. So it could be a while. But see you guys later. Like and subscribe if you're new around here. 
it'll help out the channel a lot. Bye. Beep.